Our report is on one of the most famous paleontologists of our time, Christy Curry Rogers. When Christy was just six years old, So she studied and learned all she could. Gotta find something on paleontology. Then one day on her birthday. Happy birthday, Christy. Hi, Mama. I got you a surprise. It's a fossil finding kit. Yes. <gasps> Thank you, Mama. Oh my God. This Amazing! Eventually, Christy went to college for biology at Montana State University and anatomical science at the State University of New York at Stony Brook. One of her teachers in New York, a paleontologist named Catherine Forrester, soon became her hero and best friend. Hi, Mrs. Forrester. Oh, well, hi, Christy. I really liked your class today. You know, you're such an inspiration to me. Thank you. You know, I hope one day you can become as great as a paleontologist as I am. Well, thank you. I hope so, too. So Christy left her home in Missouri and went to places like Zimbabwe and Madagascar. She discovered fossils of the Majungatholus and Titanosaurus dinosaurs. <gasps> Look what I found! It's a dinosaur boy! The main topics she studies are fossils of the long-necked dinosaurs, like the Titanosaur, and then the bones and evolution of dinosaurs. And did you know that Titanosaurs were the only dinosaurs that got smaller as they evolved? She was the first to discover that some dinosaurs were cannibals, and she published a book about it. She works at the Museum of Science in Minnesota and teaches geology at the McAllister College in St. Paul. Well, you see, kids, there are many types of dinosaurs. Any questions? Um, yeah, what's your favorite type of dinosaur? My favorite type of dinosaur? Good question. Hmm, purple. Now she lives with her husband, Ray Rogers, who is also a paleontologist, and their young daughter, Lily, who already loves dinosaurs.